What you see on your screen right now, it's a 4K Blu-ray ultra high definition DVD player and an AV receiver. Hi, welcome to our channel all about home electronics. In this video, we're going to show you how to connect your 4K DVD player to an AV receiver. If you're not already a subscriber to the channel, please hit the free subscription button. It's at the bottom right of the screen. Anytime we publish new tips in the future, you get notified. We're going to start right after this. Now we're looking at the back of our AV receiver, which is a Yamaha RXV683. And we're looking at the back of our 4K DVD player and the backside connections on our example television. We're going to show you two methods for connecting your 4K DVD player to an AV receiver. Because this video is how to connect a 4K DVD player to an AV receiver, we are already assuming that you have a high-speed HDMI connection between the output on the back of your 4K compatible receiver to a 4K HDMI port on the back of your 4K TV. The first and most preferred method, in our opinion, is using an HDMI cable. You'll actually need two, and they must be high-speed rated HDMI cables. Plug either end of an HDMI high-speed cable into the HDMI port on the back of the 4K DVD player. Notice on the back of our Yamaha RXV683, HDMI 4K compatible port number one is already listed as a DVD player port. You have to plug the other end of that same high-speed HDMI cable into one of the 4K compatible HDMI ports here on the back. In the second method, the HDMI output port on the back of your 4K DVD player is plugged directly into an HDMI 4K enabled port on the back of your TV. In this second method, we're going to connect the 4K DVD player to the AV receiver via the Toslink optical cable. Here is a Toslink optical cable if you've bought it brand new. There may be a protective cover on the end, gently remove that. Notice the unique shape of the fitting on the end of the toss link. Line it up to the shape of the port and press it into place. And listen for the gentle snap. Take the other end of that toss link cable and plug it into the optical port listed as Audio 1 on the back of your AV receiver. Take the other end of that optical cable and insert it into an available optical port on the back of your AV receiver. If you connect it via HDMI, like we did in this example to HDMI port number one, our 4K DVD player shows up as the model number. You would want to switch to that port. If you're connected using the Toslink optical, we would switch to AV1 because that is what we plug the Toslink wire into on the back of our AV receiver. Another setting adjustment you will want to consider is the actual program. In other words, what audio track are you actually listening to? Currently it's set to surround decode. If you're watching a movie, you will want to set it to a surround sound signal in relation to the movie you're watching. And if you happen to be listening to stereo music, you would want to set it to that as well. This concludes this video on how to connect a 4K ultra high definition Blu-ray DVD player to an AV receiver. If you have any questions, please post them in the comments below the video. Here are a few video links we hope you might find useful. If you liked this video or it helped you, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe free to our channel. Thank you for watching. Have a great day.